What up, y'all? It's Todd Entertainment Show. Chilling with my man Jay Kennedy on this Trayvon Martin situation. This is part two. You know why we got these hoodies on. We not gangsters. We not thugs. We not like Zimmerman. We don't go out and just shoot people in the back because they look suspicious. We don't do stuff like that. And even if we did, I don't think we'll be here doing this show. We'll yeah. probably be doing it in a, in a steel motel that they call it. But we're going to touch on this stand your ground provision, which is in the state of Florida, right? Might be yeah. in some other ones, yeah, but, I mean, but state of Florida. Yeah. Particularly right now, talking about Florida. But, you know, to stand your ground, you know, back in 2005, yeah. the stand yeah. your ground provision was was enacted in a law. And and when it came about, there was lots of debate about it. You had a, the former uh, uh, police chief uh, that, 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 that was disputing it. And, and he was saying, you know, this this is an outrageous law. I mean, you can it have is, little man. kids. I'm, I'm you can have like little now, kids trick or treating, you know, dressed up as who knows what, and somebody thinks they're looking suspicious or or, or feels endangered. Yeah. And basically, and, and basically, it goes it goes to this. I mean, it, of the law, the normal laws or how it is now, is if something happens in public, and something happens to you, and somebody's attacking you, you're supposed to back down or you know flee. Now, they and 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 a lot of this stand your ground uh, has come up. Uh, I think Florida was one of the first states, if not the first, to come up with this stand your ground provision. Yeah, it was and, a- and 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 what it means is that, like I said, you can do deadly. I mean, excuse me, a person, a person may use deadly force in self defense. When there is reasonable belief that a threat without obligation to retreat first, without obligation to retreat first, so you feel that your life or your your I mean you don't have to be your life. You feel that somebody's about to do you bodily harm, or or you got fear of that, then you have the right to use deadly force. And not only that, and 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 and, and here's and here's the and here's the uh, added additive to this that if a person Say the person who is uh, attacking you uh, says, "Okay, I'm, I'm, you know, they back down, or or they, you know, and, and it's part of it. They they actually wrote this into the law that that the person who was uh, attacking you, you know, if they're attacking you, uh, decides to stop and and wants to and wants to, uh, I guess, give up. Then you still have the right." To continue with deadly, with the use of deadly force, you know, and according to that provision, you're justified in it, and you don't, you don't go to, you don't have to go to jail, and and the thing about this is that since this has been uh, established as, as a law, uh, as of May 2010, 31 states. Have used this uh, like the type of castle doctrine they have, yeah. what they have, yeah. which is basically the home, and uh, and to stand your ground. And not only that, even more states are or are, are have them in their in their house of legislative bodies right now, moving through. You know, so 31 states right now have it, and more, or have them in, have them working through the uh, legislative process as we speak. You know, so and, and where does this come from? Well, a lot of a lot of these laws come from these groups like the NRA. You know, they push it. You know, uh, yeah, they gonna push it because it's National guns, Rifle Association. Man. What I'm talking about? It's selling guns. You know, they I mean exactly, that, man. And it's all about business. They gonna push that. Not only that, but. It's, it's, it's the shoot first, ask questions later mentality. And that's what happened down in Sanford, Florida. Actually, it was shoot first, and they we, we take your word the, for we it. We never ask the questions. It's just shoot, shoot first, first, tell us what happened, we self believe Self-defense. Self-defense. And and, 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 and and they say, and they say, we, they didn't have no grounds to arrest them. Well, I'm gonna, gotta, call, I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call BS on that right now. You got a because dead human being. I'm gonna call BS ground. on that right now because you had instances of this happening in previous cases. 
and what happened to the people? They were arrested. And then, then it, they had went up to the courts to see if, if stand your ground came into play. But they were arrested at the, at, at the time of the incident. Man, you, you know why this dude wasn't arrested. You, exactly. you, you, they, you know, you know, you know, up, you know why, you know why he wasn't arrested. He wasn't arrested. They pull up, they see a black guy, a black on kid the ground, on the man. ground with a hoodie on, and this guy Zimmerman, who's the neighborhood watch, who, 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 who's white, car- who's carrying a gun, who's white, who's carrying a gun. He's white and Peruvian. He's white. Oh, you when you look at him, I, I, I see Hispanic. I, I see Hispanic all day. But you know. I see Hispanic. I mean, but like I said, we talked about this in part one. You, you, you don't have to be white to be racist. You don't have to be that. Nah, you can be. White, you just can, white people can, aren't the only, only racist people. You can be any color and be you racist. Know? Exactly. And Any color, man. And they see this, and like I said, they take his word for it. They do not do p- proper police work. They didn't do their jobs, just point blank. They didn't do their job. You know, I mean, they, 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 they job, basically man. had it as an open and shut case. This guy, right there. This is, this, this is we, we, we believe what you say. Anything that contradicted that, they tried to change it to fit with Zimmerman. The, the coercion. They tried to, the, 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 they tried to coerce the other, you know, witnesses, witnesses to change their statements to fit more of what the other statements were. That's a red flag right there. That's a red flag. And why is that? That's a guaranteed why, red why flag. Why is that? That's the injustice right here. It's, it's, it's the admitting of guilt. You admitted guilt to me by doing that. Exactly. And, 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 and here's the thing. And, this, and, and, and I, I, I preach this a lot. <laughs> I do. And if, 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 you follow, if you follow me on Facebook or something like that, you know, or, you know, I, 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 talk, I, I talk about issues, you know. I talk about issues a lot that's going on in the day, you know, from social issues to political issues and all that. But this is why it's so important to be involved in, in the day-to-day operations of your lives, from politically to social issues, you know, to educational issues. This is why it's so important to be involved because while you while you probably looking down or or, or 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 maybe you know glued to watch something that might be on TV, you know, Real Housewives or something like that. These laws are being coming up. These laws are being enacted, and they've been enacted. And I, I know a lot of people didn't know these laws were enacted. They didn't think something like this could happen in this day and time, you know. But, I mean, they didn't think it could happen at this day and time. They thought we got so far past where we got to here. But, no, nah, we, we, I mean, you, you, got, you got these back. people enacting laws that are regressing, taking away, taking away some of your rights. You know? You got people taking away rights, and they're making their laws. And you got to pay attention to all this stuff now. I mean, when you don't pay attention, stuff like this happens. These people ram it through. The 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 house, you know, I mean, they 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 ram it through the house in the in their uh, congressional houses in the states, and it becomes law. And then just what? Like Something it did like this Florida happens. In 2005. Right, and you had people fighting was, it. Then yeah. it, it it got a little. I mean, it, it got a little publicity, but it, it did. It, it, I, it, it did. It did. But it didn't have enough outcry. It didn't have enough. It didn't have enough outcry. It wasn't enough people going against it, stating. That they wanted to uh, end the law. You had some people that, that that was going against it, and they tried, and they, then they tried to compromise to, to lessen it, because you know it was a it was a Republican controlled uh, you know Congress for them, and and like I said, it, it, it got pushed through. So all all this stuff that happens, you know, say this is why you got to be vigilant on these issues that happen because this this is the outcome. This is the outcome. You got a you got a dead seventeen year old kid on the who who who's, who's six feet underground right now, and his killer, his murderer, is still sitting free, watching television almost or whatever. Almost a month whatever, later, his, 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 almost a month later, he's still sitting free. Has not been arrested. 
the evidence and all that. that the the, 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 the murder weapon. Seen. He still got his gun. The murder weapon. Is, he still has all that. It's no reason that we had to come to this, that people had to march in the streets. People had to hold rallies. People got to wear hoodies now. And they still holding rallies. And this they guy still, still ain't been arrested. They still marching. It's, it's probable cause to arrest this guy just off the basis alone of everything that's come out. You sure, you've heard it the was, 911 dude. tapes. You've heard the witnesses. You, I mean, you, 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 you've seen the police work that was done that wasn't properly done. You got to have not a federal, not a federal authorities got to get involved. The, the FBI got to come down, and, you know, and, and, and do Sanford's work for them because they're letting a killer walk free. He's walking free. Exactly, and and and, and he, he and, walking, man. He's, he's walking free. He man. chill. He at home probably right now, talking about he getting death threats. He had to change his phone number numerous times. Okay, this guy is dead. He's dead. He's dead. Cause he, he ain't changing phone numbers, man. Yeah, cause, cause, cause he got shot. You was his death threat, and you took it. You, you killed him. You shot him. That's point blank. Exactly. You, you did pursued it. him. You the, followed the, the him. Nine one one dispatcher told, told you, you not, not to. to. Not to dis. Not. And what and did you do anyway? You, you, you went ahead and followed them, and they, and look what happened. You're not a police officer. You weren't trained. You want to register uh, neighborhood watch, and you and even if you were a registered neighborhood watch, you're not allowed to carry weapons of any kind. You're supposed to be the eyes and the ears of the police department. You call them. You report what you see, and that's the end of it. You let them do the police work. Does he have a gun permit? He had. I think he did. Yeah, he had a gun okay. permit. Yeah, he had a gun permit. I, 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 this, this. I, I, I assume that he did have a gun permit. I mean, the, the police department does did such a horrible job. We, we don't know if they checked that though. But I mean, after we, we don't know if we don't know if they checked that. I, I'm we, we don't know. It has. I, I, it's better been checked now. I mean, but I mean, you what, know. But wasn't and this too wasn't Zimmerman removed from the community college he was going to? Yeah, he was. Because they got tired of all the attention that he was getting. Right. I mean, and and, and, and the, the, the college removed him, told him to stop come stop coming to class, because of all the controversy from him. The college, the institution of learning, told him to stop coming. And 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 and, and, here's, uh -uh. and here's another thing I, I want to touch off. I want to touch on um, people who uh, critics, pundit, whatever you want to call them, be on TV, saying that. Maybe this was an accident. Could it could it could it just been an accident, or, or why why should, why was he wearing a hoodie? He, Man, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say this, had, dude. If he had the hoodie had more to do with the death than, than if he of. if he if he didn't have on a hoodie, I think he'll still be dead today. No, 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 no but forget that. And I, and, 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 and I know but, but, I know I know it's forget and, that, and, man. And, and, I know, but, look, but this, this it's, it's 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 the whole point of. The hoodie and, and gangster. First of all, no. It was raining. It was raining. What was he doing protecting his head? He had on clothes. He was protecting he his clothes. head, man. He had on a hoodie with some Skittles and iced tea. Not not wearing hoodies are a problem slow, though, man. Or, or I guess uh, 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 so. he was. Yeah, he, he was, was walking. We, we, we don't know. He was, he was walking. talking on the phone. He walking. was walking and looking around. We don't know how slow he was walking, but he was suspicious. But he was suspicious and up to no good. Man, I, he was suspicious because he was black. And he had I'm a, sorry, yeah. man. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, cause, cause he, Cause he, he was he had a, black. He had a black man walking around who didn't belong and who did not belong. Oh, 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 what, 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 what is do not belong? Is it because he never seen him before? You don't know what somebody belonged. No, apparently, because he went, cause Man, said, cause he went here, around dude. to the neighbors and told them be on the lookout for suspicious black men. Get out of here. He he didn't belong. That's BS in itself. And and that's BS, man. It is. He didn't belong. It is. It, it, it looks to me that Zimmerman didn't belong in the neighborhood. That dude's the thug, man. 
that dude's the gangster. He, he, he's a wanna, he's a wannabe cop who takes justice into his own. Or ain't it wasn't even justice. That who wasn't took, justice, who, who man. Took the law into his own hands. Who took the law into his own hands? Pursue Trayvon because Trayvon, because. And, and 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 this one and, and, and like that, I said, the that, police showed up and he had a bloody nose and stuff on the back of his head. Trayvon probably did whip his butt because Trayvon because it was self it was stuff it was self because defense he got pushed exactly because he was pursued it was, he was it, was by a person. it was self defense it was self defense from him he was defending himself from some grown punk with a gun who says somebody looks suspicious. A grown punk. He ain't even a man. I don't. I don't doubt that dude. I that dude ain't even a man. I don't doubt that there was a witness seeing him whip his whip his butt. Come on, man. I don't doubt it. Come on. Man. I don't doubt. It. They probably did. They probably <laughs> did see Trayvon start to tear off in him, which is justifiable exactly by me. Exactly, it's justifiable. It's justifiable by me. You but run up. You run up on me talking about what am I doing here? And you push me or something? We gonna fight. I'm feeling for my life. We gonna fight. I'm gonna stand my ground. Yeah, I'm gonna. We gonna it. fight. Exactly. And then this, and then this punk pull out a gun and shoot him. Not a man, a punk. Not a man, a punk. Just think about it. You talk. You, you saying. You saying. And this is what you saying. You telling your lawyer. You got your lawyer on TV saying. You got to be, he has to be careful when he goes to the store. I mean, dummy, you still have the opportunity to do that. Can Trayvon go to the store like he just did when you hunted him down? He was going to the store to get Skittles, man. You can still go to the store. You talking about you getting death threats. You kill somebody, man. Really? Really? You want sympathy because you getting death threats? You should get them. He should get them. He should. should I'm surprised ain't nobody done tuned him up by now, man. Arrested, man. Taken, taken, and put on trial, and also brought up on hate charges. And why? why, Because it's a hate crime. And why do I say brought up on hate charges? Because when this first came out, I kind of I sat back and I was like, I don't know if I'm not sure if it's a hate crime just yet. What's the basis of it? What's the basis of it being a hate crime? But you, but when you start listening to what transpired in the 911 call and yeah. what he said, you know, you hear him on there talking about these a holes always get away. They then, get away. Day. Then, day. The, 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 day. the operative have, word. I, day. I, he said, he said, this, 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 yeah, a suspicious individual, a black male up to no good. What is he doing? He's walking around with his hands in his pocket, looking around at houses. He's up to no good. How's that up to no good? Not only that, you 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 heard on the on the call saying effing coons or something of that nature, and if it is effing coons and you pursue him still, that's a hate crime. That's a you hate pursue crime, him dude. because he was black, and on the basis that you had a negative, uh, you had a negative viewpoint towards black males being in your neighborhood, and, and, and that's why you pursued him. And if and if what and if what the other statement that's true by the girlfriend that was on the phone, that's a hate crime. And, 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 and this is my thing too. If you're if you're if you're so called neighborhood watch, you were doing a very bad job of it. Number one, because you said someone was walking slowly. With your neighborhood this. watch, you're supposed to watch, watch. Yeah. I, I I never heard of neighborhood watch pulling out gats and shooting people. I never heard of that. For one, you 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 didn't even watch the dude because you didn't even know he was on the phone. Or maybe you did and you just ignored you saw, that. Or you, you saw, maybe ignored you that. You saw what you wanted to see. You saw a black man. And 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 you saw and, a and black a, and, and, and a look, black look, man and, and, and this, walking and, down the street. This is what's disturbing about it though. He's he's a black man, he's got a hoodie on. Anything else he's doing, you take that you take the black man part away, and it's perfectly normal. You walking down the street. He's looking walking a, home, man. Around. He was walking home. And it's raining. He was walking he home. He was walking home. He was going home. In your neighborhood, watch. You're supposed to watch. You're supposed to be the eyes and the ears of the police department. You call it in. You phone it in. You tell them what you see. And you take your butt back home. Exactly. You're not a cop. You're not a constable. 
you make you make the statements these a holes always get away, and you're following him, and you stop running after him after Trayvon takes off. Running. And if he did because hit you, Trayvon starts and- taking off running. <laughs> now, oh, that's verified. It. He is doing. He's up. He is up to no good. And if he ran, why why would he come back to you? If he ran from you, why would he come back to you as you're getting into your SUV and hit you? Why would he come back to you if he's running from you? If a strange dude, well, nah. well, first of all, nah, you, he attacked you when you. He said he got back to his truck and he got attacked. Well, the <laughs> body was found over over in between the houses over in the sidewalk. Yeah, yeah. He wasn't by the car. He wasn't by his truck. So it's it's just holes all in this dude's statement. Just all in it, man. But the fact remains, this dude is out. He's still free. Still free to go about his life. He killed somebody, man. Almost a man. month later, still no justice to the family. The 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 father and the mother have have buried their son. They have buried their son. This could have been and this could have been your son. This could have been me. This could have been this could have been Mike. This could have been any of us. President Obama spoke out about it. President Obama said, if I had a son, he'd look like Trayvon. Deep. And that's true. The president's son. Deep. The president of the United States son. Just because he had a hoodie on. We got. I mean, we got to. Th- we got to think about stuff like this, man. The the injustice that's going on. I mean, the injustice that's going on is 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 just sickening. That is that stuff like this still happens to this day. And and Trayvon is just the Trayvon case is just one instance. And, and, and it's and just small. It's happened. just small, man. It's just a small <laughs> piece, man. I mean, it, it, it is it, a this small. This has been going piece. on and on and on every day. I mean, every you, day. Like I said, you, uh, you, you, what you got? The guy bailed that was shot in New York, who was about to get married at the time by the cops. You know, and they unloaded on that dude. Yeah, man. One, one police officer fired like thirty-one shots at the guy. They unloaded on 31 that dude. Thirty-one shots out of fifty. That was. I think they either was shot or he was hit by. But thirty-one shots. One cop, thirty-one shots. Zimmerman, it's not a cop. Are we that? Fi- I mean, are we, are we that scary? Are people that scared of the black race? I just don't get it. Are people that scared of the black race? And 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 and, and look, the crime is not being scared of black people. Go ahead, be scared of black people. The crime ain't being scared of them. The crime was pursuing them when 911 dispatcher told you not to, and then having a gun on you and pulling it out and shooting. And and using it, man. And then you got in a confrontation with them and probably started to get your, probably started to get towed into. But, man, this this is the point. You You confront somebody, man. Of course they're gonna come back at you. That dude ain't have a gun. Put yourself put yourself come on, man. I'm serious. Everybody out here. Come on, everybody dude. Everybody come out on, dude. Put yourself in Trayvon. Put yourself in Trayvon Martin's shoes. Put yourself in that dude's shoes. You went to the store to get some Skittles for your brother and some and you got a can of Arizona iced tea. You're walking home. It's raining. You go into the entrance of the neighbor, the gated neighborhood. You walk in, and it starts raining, and you probably got to rain for a little bit. I don't know. And, you know, you got a hoodie. You put your hoodie on. You got your hands. You know, you got your hands in, and you're walking, and you're talking on the phone with your significant other. I mean, and you're having a conversation, and then you see somebody's a suspicious character following you <laughs> and just, just keep continuously following you. And, you know, 
and you and the person that you're on the phone with tells you to run and you know finally you you do take off and the guys take running off after you and, and you ask them you say, why hey man why are you following me what are you doing here what you know and now in 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 and and this is and you know, like I said, like I said what kind of gets me, what gets me mad with, with some of the other people, you know, they had their comments about not wearing a hoodie. It, it was so much more the hoodie's fault than that. What did, what did Trayvon do wrong? He had a hoodie on? What, black people can't wear hoodies now? He was walking home. All he did was walk home. He was going home. Sound like Zimmerman was the troublemaker. Sound like Zimmerman the was the suspicious one. Sound like Zimmerman was the one looking at houses because he's neighborhood watch. The instigator, all right. The instigator. He, he instigated the whole thing. He took the law. But what's 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 what's, what's sad? What's sad is still it's no free. resolution. What's sad is that he is still free right now. There's no resolution His whatsoever. Is, 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 Trayvon's parents had to bury him, put him to rest, and his killer is still on the There's no resolution. Y'all think about that, man. Are people that scared of black people? Are we that suspicious? Are you going to get involved in, in, in the politics in your state off of some of these laws that have been going on? Are you going to stand for it? Or is it going to be a fad once this Trayvon stuff is over with, you just move on to whatever else you was doing? Can't stop now. We ain't wearing these hoodies for nothing. We ain't going to stop here. We're going to keep moving. Put yourself in Trayvon shoes. It's the Tart Entertainment Show.